Every responsible reptile keeper needs to know one thing. Where does this animal come from in the wild and what kind of heat and light requirements does it have? So it starts, of course, with daytime. The sun comes up in the morning, goes down in the evening, and in between you need a light that projects light, that projects heat and light. There are different lights to different things. UVB, UVA deliver that type of spectrum. Most animals, though, don't require all the UVB and UVA and can get by with a simple daytime light bulb. This has got a coating on it called neodymium that provides full spectrum lighting and a, a great array of colors will appear on your animal if you put the proper neodymium light on it. The Jungle Bright light bulb is designed to do just that. It's available in a couple different wattages from 60 to 150. So depending on where your animal comes from and its heat requirements, this is the ticket, the Jungle Bright neodymium. If you need to put some heat a little bit more concentrated in a spot, the answer then would be the white hot spotlight. This is a spotlight. It projects things directly down. It'll concentrate that down to a, a basking spot in the animal's cage, perhaps a log or a slate or a piece of rock. Really important to have that so the animal, after he eats, can go over and digest, where the neodymium bulb is a, a regular incandescent light bulb that will project the light a little wider and throughout the enclosure. Either way, you need to have one of these two bulbs in most of your tanks, and the most important thing is, as the sun goes down at night, make sure you turn them off in the evening. They do not need lights in their eyes all 24 hours a day. That's usually very, very aggravating to the animal. We'll talk about nighttime lights later on.